Uh, I'd like to thank the uh, Chamber of Commerce for allowing us this time to uh, help us celebrate our state championship track team. Um, I'd also like to thank uh, Dave Sattler and the City of Coldwater as they're working on the entrance signs uh, to the city uh, to recognize these young gentlemen and their accomplishments that they, um, uh, that, that they had this year. Um, and lastly, I'd also like to thank the Boosters Club for the trophies that these uh, young men are going to get tonight. Um, when we celebrate at the end of the year, we thought that this was our first state championship in Coldwater history, but our history buff, uh, Coach Billsboro, uh, came to me today and said, hey, I went through the state uh, library today and went through some old uh, newspapers, and this is actually our second state championship. Our first one was in 1923. And so this is actually our second state championship. I'd first like to uh, recognize the coaches, and uh, one that couldn't be here tonight is Stephanie Young. She helps us with the sprinters. Um, the next one is uh, Mr. Jim Billsboro. He's uh, our distance running coach. Come on up here, coach. And uh, works with our hurdlers. And he's kind of the modern day father of track. He's been coaching track for 40 some years, I think, here. Um, and he was even my coach at one time. The next uh, guy I'd like to call up here is uh, Coach Mike McConnell. He is our throwing coach. And these gentlemen are both. These gentlemen are extremely important to our program, and you're going to see in a minute when I start announcing these young gentlemen um, and the, what they did for us. First, now the, the reason that we're here to recognize these uh, these young men. Uh, the first one I'm going to talk about is uh, Logan Fee. He could not be here. I don't think he's here today. He was uh, one of our guys that did everything. I think the only thing he didn't do for us was uh, um, some field events, and so uh, he couldn't make it here today, unfortunately. Uh, the next gentleman also couldn't make it because he's living in Mexico now, uh, getting ready for college. He's going to come back up here to um, in Chicago to Trinity College to play soccer. As uh, Tyler Cooey, he was on our 4x200 meter uh, relay team and our mile relay team that, that made it to the state finals. Our next athlete is Mr. Matt Gipple. Is a, uh, down, was on our 4x200 meter relay team at the state championship meet and he was also part of that relay team that set a new school record in that event and the previous school record was set back in 1973 I believe. Uh, the next gentleman is Mr. Mo Sala. Mo qualified in the 4x200 meter relay team and the 4x800 meter relay team. Next is uh, Kyle Folk. Woo! Kyle qualified in the uh, 4x800 meter relay team and in the mile run. He's also, uh, him and uh, Matt Gipple and Kyle are also only sophomores, so we're, we're going to be bringing them back. And plus, Kyle just got done competing in a national uh, contest and did extremely well out there. So we're looking forward to having those guys back again. Uh, next is Mr. Ben Fagan. He was part of our 4x800 four, four meter relay team. And he is also on the school record board for the 4x800 meter relay team. Next is Mr. Adam Bailey. Adam qualified in the 200 meter dash, the 4x200 meter relay, the mile relay, and the 300 hurdles for the state meet. And he took second in the 300 meter hurdles for us at the state meet. Now the next Guys, I'd like to call up. I kind of like to call them up as a group um, to acknowledge them. This is something that I don't know if it's ever happened in the state of Michigan. Last year, we sent seven throwers to the state finals, which was something that was never even heard of. Um, this year, we sent three throwers. 
But on top of that, we went one, two, three in the shot put at the state meet, which I don't know if that's ever been done before. So I'd like to call these gentlemen up here. Mr. Zach Gipple took second in the shot put, and you can see why. He's so a little bit bigger than little brother there. Um, Cole Taggart took third in the shot put and seventh in the discus. And he is going to continue his track career at Central Michigan University this fall. And then Dylan Taggart, little brother, took first in the shot put and first in the discus for us this year. And he's only a sophomore. And we got some big things to look forward to for him. And last but not least is Mr. Shweb of Jobly, Mr. Distance. Shweb qualified in four events, uh, the 4 by 800 meter relay, the 800 meter relay, the mile run, and the two mile run. He won the mile and he finished third in the 3200 meter or the two mile run. And Schwabe is going to continue his career at the University of Wisconsin to run for them this fall. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is your 2018 Division II State Championship Track Team.